me, guys. No, oh, Jesus, no. Hey, Exobro here with some quick and easy team play tips that'll help you win big in Phasmophobia. Before you grab at all that equipment, know what roles you're gonna play and the gear loadout for each. Do you like to thrill the hunt? Recon might be just a role for you. Maybe you like hanging back and just compiling the evidence to see what kind of haunting you're actually dealing with. Support is just the right role for you. <laughs> It's smart to break into two teams consisting of one recon and one support role. Team 1 and 2 should start on opposite sides of the house going room to room scanning each room's temperature and electromagnetic fields for fluctuations. Normal room temperatures are around 61 to 65 Fahrenheit, but you're looking for a haunted room. They're between 40 and 50 degree Fahrenheit. Speed is key here, and you're gonna wanna find the room before your sanity drops too low and you have angry ghosts beating at your door. Now you should have all the items required to investigate immediately and find the clues needed to finish and get paid faster. A picture is worth a thousand words. Try to maximize your paycheck with photos of your investigation. Fingy prints, fingy prints. Give me a kiss. Here's a list of some photo ops to look for during your investigations. Once your journal is filled with enough pictures and completed most of your optional tasks, you should leave before it gets too dangerous. Remember, I did it, I did it, he sacrificed himself for us, dude, holy shit. Dead ghost hunters don't get paid. I hope these tips helped you to maximize your phasmophobia payouts. And thanks for watching. Until next time.